He lets the readers of his blog choose a new living destination every four months and he's here with us today to give us the tips and tricks of adapting into a new city. Uh, welcome Colin. What's your most important uh, tip on settling in uh, a new city? The, the advice I give most commonly to people who are moving to a new culture in particular is to just be very open and approach it the same way you would approach primary school, where uh, understanding that every child around you knows more than you do about everything going on. And if you can go in with that attitude and be very humble about it, ask a lot of questions and be willing to uh, accept the answers that you get, typically you don't have any trouble uh, learning about the culture, figuring out how to shop at the grocery store and other common things. So, and if you don't mind me asking, um, traveling around the world full time, aren't you ever lonely? Don't you miss your home, your friends? You know, people ask me that a lot as well. And I, I often say no, actually. It's, it's not that I don't miss them in some ways, but we live in the future. And as a result, there's no longer goodbye. There's only see you later. Uh, very often I'll hop on an airplane and I can immediately hop on the Wi-Fi in flight and be talking to the same people that I've just left behind in the country that I've left. So I, as a result, I, I can connect with these people later in life and, and very often I do. So those connections maintain as long as we want them to be maintained. And what kind of person do you have to be to um, live without a home? Oh, you have to be very comfortable uh, being uncomfortable. It's, it's not easy traveling around all the time and not having a home base. And it's not easy constantly being exposed to new foods and new smells and new languages and new uh, ways of operating day to day. And so you really, really have to enjoy novelty and learning new things. And that has to supersede basically the fact that everything that you do is a little bit uncomfortable. Okay, thank you for sharing with us today, Colin. And uh, for you guys at home, if you want to know more about being a full-time traveler, make sure to check out the article below and see the link to Colin's free book.